messaging me asking me to start recording again, doing some new things um, to show them what this game is about. To be honest, I'm s still in the. <laughs> this game is brand new to all of us, so I'm still trying to figure a few things out. But um, we've got an event coming up here. First time this event has happened. I have no idea what's going to happen. It's uh, kind of a guild war. They call it uh, Star Relics on here. Um, just to let you know, if you start playing this game, what you want to do to set yourself up for this is you go into League, and then up here on the top right corner, you click on Dispatch Heroes, and then you click on this. Now it says here you can't dispatch heroes five minutes before the League War starts. Um, but you can s okay battle has begun blah 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 but anyway you can see here I've set up my teams you can have teams of five depending on how many heroes you have uh, this girl Smexy Death has got all of the heroes so she's got a butt ton of teams um, but anyway let's see so here's the symbol for it here go ahead and click on it we'll go ahead and enter um, now that's something that you need to um, uh, sign up for your your league leader needs to sign up for during the week he has he or she has to be level 40 to be able to sign up for that and you have to have at least 10 people in your league so uh, just so you know when you start playing this so uh, here's the interface this is an hour-long event um, I have no idea what's going on the, apparently, let me go back here. Uh, and if you look at this, basically the way it works is there's a defending league, and the other teams, uh, the other leagues are trying to beat that league in, into becoming first place. If you get first place, you get rewards during the week. I'm not sure if um, other places, second place, third place, whatever, also get rewards during the week. So um, I'll let you know after we're done here. But this will say the win as it says here, the winner will own star relics, whatever the hell that means, until the next war unlocks. Um, and so right now, the way that works, since this is the very first one, um, the fir uh, here it says number three, the first applier will become the defender for the first unlock. So this team, basically, I hit apply uh, several days ago. You can see here, and it tells you what times each team applied, each league applied. 10 teams total here and so right now looking over the teams um, hopefully my team hopefully my league has a pretty good chance of winning this thing you can see our BR is a lot higher uh, just as with every other game though BR does not always mean everything uh, it really you know also how your team is set up what heroes you have in this game um, but anyway let's go see what's going on here with this No idea. It says defender victory. Start clicking on stuff. Huh. I'm not sure if this is because of lag. seem to be anything on the screen yet. Okay. As you can see, clicking on this does nothing right now. We'll click on here. Click on the X to get out, see if I can get out of this damn thing. doesn't really want to let me leave. BR 56,982. Hmm. 
Oh, seems to be a whole lot of nothing happening. This is probably the results, actually, just uh, blank results, since this is the first one to actually happen. Not sure why it's not letting me out of here. Let me go ahead and just try to refresh. Hopefully this doesn't screw up the recording like it used to do in the past, but I, I think I've got it set up to where it doesn't do that. I shouldn't do that now. That was only on Wartoon because of the way the window is set up there. Get out of that music. Go back to Star Relics. So, can't really watch anything, can't really do anything. Um, so it does seem to be all automatic. So uh, if you guys do start playing this game, I'll post my link for this in the comments below the video. Uh, it, it's a fun little game. It doesn't take too much of your time or concentration or anything. Uh, you do get a lot of free diamonds in here. Um, it is, and you, I know some people will ask if, the, if you're only on an alpha server right now and the alpha server is going to reset in a week, why are some of us recharging? Um, the reason for that is that recharging is the only way to get your VIP level. Um, VIP you can get starting at level one and it's like two dollars or something like that I think is the minimum recharge and that will get you VIP level one forever. It's not something you have to buy monthly like in some other games like Wartoon and stuff like that. And the, the benefits you get um, are up in here. But the reason that we're recharging, even though it's only an alpha server, is that they've done a thing where even though all of our characters and everything will be reset, we will still get all the diamonds plus a bonus. So, hey, you know me, I love free shit. So they say, hey, you know, spend a little bit and you'll get a bonus of free stuff. That I say, okay, hell yeah, I get free shit. So anyway, uh, if you want to just look at the kind of stuff you get here. Um, purchasing stamina that's kind of the biggest thing in this game is constantly running out of stamina to run um, blitzes and, and uh, run campaigns and stuff like that and that's what you need to be able to do to um, get gear for your heroes and increase your heroes and stuff like that so uh, that's kind of a good thing the more of this that you can buy and you don't have to um, buy diamonds for this with the amount of diamonds you get free in here you can buy stamina daily just with the free diamonds they give you. So, uh, double some login rewards, blah, 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 more stuff, more stuff, more stuff. Seen some people with this already, already spent $800 on this game. That's a little crazy for me, but hey, if you got the money, go for it. Um, <laughs> level 15 VIP, $10,000. Yeah, that's crazy. But anyway, yeah, lots of, lots of stuff in there, just... Um, but this game is really good for uh, free players as well, and I'll show you why. When you're building up your heroes here, there's not a lot to spend on this game yet. There's not mounts and wings and all this crap that you get in other games that it gives the cashers this huge advantage. Um, what you do with diamonds on this game is you can spend a little bit to, to get extra attempts, extra stamina, stuff like that but it doesn't really help you get a lot stronger so what some of the free players are doing is they're taking their diamonds they're only getting a couple of heroes and they're making those heroes as strong as possible using all their resources just on those heroes um, whereas people like me uh, I'm not super strong as far as ranking right now because I'm trying to test out everything that I can before the real server comes. That way I know, okay, what are the good heroes that I need to concentrate on? What do I need to go for? Stuff like that. But uh, let me show you rankings on here. So you can see, yeah, all these people um, in the top here, they're all big cashers. Look at this person. No no VIP, has, hasn't spent a dime on here, just using free... Um, well, this is only level, so that doesn't really mean anything, but they they're, haven't spent anything just using the free diamonds they get, and they're keeping up, you know, almost top 10. Heroes, got someone number 13 here, completely free player. 19, 23, 24. It is possible to get along here in um, without spending a lot, or spending at all, if you want. So uh, this isn't... Uh, you know, a lot of the problems that I have with games like Wartoon and uh, League of Angels, especially the last couple months, is 
they get away from skill and it just becomes who has the most money and you can be totally shitty at games as long as you have a lot of money you're going to be the top player um, and that you know that's why I left Wartune and that's why I'm getting away from League of Angels as well but this game since it is a brand new game it's not concentrating on who has the most money it's you know they're trying to get free players in here as well give you some uh, benefits like I said you get a lot of free diamonds in this just for doing um, just for logging in every day uh, let me see here if it's yeah as you can see diamonds 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 I mean there's not anything too spectacular uh, there was a seven day login I guess it's gone since I've done all seven days but every day that you log in for the, of course the first seven days you get a pretty decent amount of diamonds just completing quests daily these quests down here some of the rewards um, there you go diamond plus ten that's not very much but uh, I'm not gonna go through all these some of these do have some nice diamonds in them some of your regular quests over here uh, the game quests or whatever the hell you wanna call them um, also give diamonds so this overall so far is a pretty good game I'm enjoying it uh, anybody that knows me at all knows I just love comic book stuff um, and it's cute you know I've had some complaints from people on my fan page saying oh but it looks like it's for kids and stuff like that well yeah so what so it's cute who the hell cares I, you know I'm a grown ass man sitting at home playing video games for a living I can do whatever the hell I want it's cute for me so um, and it's superhero stuff but um, I'm just kind of trying to pass a little time here to see if anything happens in the Star Relics. Uh, let's go ahead and enter again. See if anything has happened. If it freezes up again, I'll probably just stop the recording. Yeah, it seems like it's seems like it's just frozen. So, all right. Well. I'll try to post some results later. Um, it's most likely my league will end up getting first place in this if, if everything goes as planned. Uh, and I'll probably post a screenshot of that on my fan page. Um, for anybody that's not a follower of me on uh, follower of me on Facebook, you can just do a search for the Thrill, or uh, you can search for my real name on there. I think there's a couple different. Well, there's a lot of people with my name, but um, it's not too hard to find me. Uh, if you do a search for the Threll, it also comes across my personal page too. Um, I used to have my name as the Threll on there, and some asshole decided to report me for having a fake name, so I had to change my name. And uh, yeah, that was retarded. But anyway, you can follow me on Facebook, and um, you know I, I, I do look forward to trying to play with some of you guys. I do get a lot of positive feedback and a lot of people want to come join this game just to be able to talk with me hang out with me a bit uh, I, I love doing that kind of stuff unfortunately um, there we are very limited as far as like joining my league we can only fit 20 people I think that's because this is only an alpha server and there's no way to upgrade the league right now but I'm sure once the regular servers kick online in about a week or so that I'll be able to fit more people in the league and um, you know, I'll try to be more proactive about booting people who are not active players and getting in active players. Because uh, believe me, it, it really sucks for me when I get, you know, 10, 20, 30 people a day asking, hey, can I join your league? Hey, I want to join your league. Come on, Thrill. Hey, I want to play with you, man. I, and I, I just can't. I can't. There's nothing I can do about it. But um, I do hope that uh, when the new servers come out, the, the actual online servers, that we'll be able to get a lot more of you guys fit into the league and um, hopefully all the players that I've got playing with me right now will uh, be able to join the same server because I think what they're going to do is have a, a few different servers open up at the same time across different time zones and I'll, I'll probably try to go on a Euro uh, European server just because I'm usually stuck on an American server and living in Romania and trying to play on an American server just really sucks so I'll probably try to get on a European server and hope that um, hope that enough of my fans are happy with that I know no matter what I do people are gonna be some somebody's gonna be unhappy but you know I gotta try to do something for myself once here so um, anyway that's uh, tiny mighty and just look for the link in my comments if you guys want to come join me on this game if you have any questions or if there's something that uh, you're having problems with in this game or you want to see me record you guys know I'm all about just doing what you guys want me to do so uh, if you have requests just let me know and I will do my best to try to get them recorded for you 
and uh, hoping in the future to you know get some more of these videos going I do enjoy doing them when I have the time and um, when I can when I can uh, you know put something together but just need suggestions from you guys League of Angels was not really very good for recording Lord's Road was horrible for recording because it was all AFK everything which is why I stopped playing that but um, this game it, there's a little bit more action in it. it it's somewhat AFK but you do have some control over some things but if you guys are having problems with stuff just let me know and I'll do my best to help you out thank you very much